the leak also made those of us who were thought to be in the majority in support of overruling Roe and Casey targets for assassination because it gave people a rational reason to think they could prevent that from happening. I want you to let that sink in for a little while. Whoever leaked this document put the justices' lives in danger. One fellow was on his way to take Brett Kavanaugh out, and Merrick Garland did nothing. So in other words, Merrick Garland was trying to hope that somebody did something to one of the justices because it's against the law to show up at a justice's house. But you're telling me that if there's not but 97 pupils working for the, the justices, and out of those 97 who had to take sworn testimony, you guys can come to the conclusion. Now, Samuel Lito said he, he has a pretty good idea who did it. Give us a name. Give us a name because if it was a liberal, I mean, if it was a conservative had leaked some on the liberals, that name would have been out already. Now, you remember January the 6th, if you just even walked on the, the grounds of the Capitol, they were going to your house, harassing you. If you use a debit card, close around the Capitol in Washington, D.C., uh, the FBI was coming after you. But you mean to tell me something as pressing as a Supreme Court justice possibly being assassinated is not of importance. I'm pretty sure they all know who did it. But they don't have the kahunas to do anything about it. Because you got to be politically correct. I'm willing to bet my right arm if a conservative had leaked something, which I don't think a real conservative would actually leak something from the Supreme Court, but just say for argument's sake, if they had leaked something, that name would have been out six months ago. And we're still waiting, but they say we're going to close the case. Our findings say we can't figure out who did it. All this technology we have, you can't find out who... When the fella so-called leaked that information about Ukraine, you wouldn't have found him mighty quick. Do you really think they don't know who actually did it? And just think about that. Alito admits that their lives was in danger. Everybody knew their lives was in danger. But the, the, the Democrats are so corrupt, so evil, they don't care if you get killed. They don't care if a justice get assassinated. But you better not hurt nobody's feelings online because those are grounds to get you removed. And you're telling me now that you know who it is and we can't find out who it is? Why is that person being protected? I'm 100% I'm sure they know who it is. 100% sure. And that means they purged themselves by lying on the oath saying they had not done anything. We know who did it. We can't even get a name. This is why we're always losing. Because the people, I get, I guarantee you, it would have got leaked already. The name of that leaker would have got leaked already. What was the Politico? He took, they took the article over there and gave it to somebody at Politico because they wanted to stop something. And so, are you telling me that you know who did it, but you're not going to tell us because you say you don't want to speculate? Interesting. Whenever the Democrats do something, whenever these liberal nut jobs do something, there's never consequences. The lockdowns wasn't a consequence. The lying about the lockdown, the vaccination, the masks, open borders, there's never a consequence. Lying on the oath, James Cummings. Lying about Classified documents, Hillary Clinton. I don't. I don't know if we can. Why have confidence in anything that these people say at this point? Because ninety-seven people work there, and you can't figure out ninety-seven. It's not important to them. They know who did it too. Ninety-seven people 
that's working for the justices, and yet we can't figure out who did it. Samuel Lito says he, he he's pretty sure who did it. He's pretty certain who did it. Can we just get a name? Give us a hint. Let's play charades. Sounds like unbelievable that they were trying to kill the justices and we took a nonchalant attitude about it. That says all you need to know right there. They took a nonchalant attitude about that. We know who the, they know who the leak is. I already knew nothing was going to happen to them. Hold your breath if you actually think they're going to do something to these people because they're not. 